Money, it makes the world go round. Not having money can be a real bummer, and especially in this current economy, where citizens around the world are losing their jobs every minute, desperate to find any way to earn extra cash. Now you can sit there watching Netflix all day and wonder why you don't have any money to go out and enjoy your life more. Or you can start for simple but creative ways to make money. Welcome to our YouTube channel, The Money Making Show where every video will show you a unique way to earn money. Whether you're still a wee little lad, a professional with a job just looking for a side hustle, or someone that just needs a bit of motivation, I'm Maximilian IV, and I will be your guide to financial freedom. Every week, I will show you simple yet effective ways to generate alternative revenue so that you can get a little closer to not ever worrying about money. Although legally, this is not financial advice. Nevertheless, let us adventure into today's topic. What are five things you can buy and resell right now and make some decent profits to reinvest into your own business ideas later on? Number one. The first on our list is something not every lad and their grandma would ever think of. We're talking about brand new and like new books found at the dollar store. If you're in the United States or similar, there are stores called Dollar Tree Dollar General or the 99 cents only store. Now you have to be very keen and wise to spot these deals, but luckily, with the help of modern technology, all you need is a smartphone and a wireless internet connection. First, when you come to the store, make sure to ask an employee if they have a book aisle, and if they do, you're in for a huge score. Many books here end up as a bulk wholesale and are upcycled from bookstores that have failed or needed to clear their shelves for newer books, so that these can be bought by the pound by large resellers like the Dollar Tree. Once you get to this aisle, the second thing you need to do is open your Amazon Seller Central app. Simply download this app from the App Store or Google Play. Register with your Amazon account. With this app, you can scan any eligible barcode to see the price it most recently sold for and the associated shipping fees, so that you can calculate your profits. Many novels are books that are sought after online book readers and collectors everywhere, and you might just find a copy that can resell for $12 to $15, when the book just costs you only $1. And after shipping and fees, you'll be able to take home $3 to $7 profit per book. Another place to look is right next to the book section, or near the toys and games. This is the coloring book section. These dollar stores work with all sorts of licensed characters from Disney cartoons and shows, and trust me, they can be a gold mine, fetching a $3 profit each book after shipping and fees. With every store carrying any number from 10 to 30 copies and multiple styles and designs, this is definitely an easy score if you know where to look. Scan them fast and grab them before everyone else catches on. Number 2. Concert Tickets Oh dear, where do we even start? Back in the good old times, even I, Maximilian IV, enjoyed a very good live performance by some of the very best electronic music DJs and producers, such as Calvin Harris, Marshmallow, and Zed. These shows always end up selling out the first day they're released, leaving many people disappointed. Many die-hard fans will do anything to surprise their girlfriends or wife with tickets to their favorite musician. Heck, I even paid $500 so that my fiancé could see Justin Bieber live. So now you can see why tickets can become rare and expensive near the performance date. This is where some crafty business sits can come into play. Now this method of buying and reselling is not something new. But with a new digital era of buying and selling items, even now, tickets don't need a physical copy to be sold. The idea here is that you will wait for a hot upcoming show and buy as many tickets as you can before they sell out. And by the week the show is supposed to premiere, Prices usually go up by 150 to 300 percent, meaning a ticket that you bought for $50 can now be sold for $75 to $150 or even more. This is because the demand for a show can grow if the show is completely sold out and anyone late to buy it before capacity was reached needs to rely on a third-party seller to secure their tickets. Now let's go over how you do this. Now you can either have a physical copy that you can list and sell to eBay, Craigslist and StubHub, 
Remember lads, it's always best to practice safe payment rules. Never ever send your tickets by mail or email before you're paid through a safe payment provider, such as PayPal or Cash in Person. And if you're going to meet someone in person to exchange the tickets, always bring a friend and meet in a public location like a Starbucks while there's still daylight. If you bought digital tickets through the Ticketmaster app, you don't need to meet up in person to sell them. There's a feature to allow you to transfer the tickets to any email address. The tickets are just a QR code that needs to be scanned by the event promoter before letting people enter. All you need to do is list your tickets either on a Facebook group for exchanging tickets or Craigslist. And after receiving a secured and verified payment, go ahead and transfer the ticket to the buyer. Number 3. Rare Sneakers Now, if you're sophisticated like I, Maximilian IV, you know that certain fashion hype beasts are willing to pay anywhere from $500 to $3,000 for a pair of rare limited run sneakers. So what are the rare sneakers and why can they be so expensive? Rare sneakers can come in all brands, such as Nike or Adidas. The reason they can get so inflated in price is because they were one out of a thousand made. And that means with a global following of people who want to add these shoes to their collection, just a flex on the haters. Some might just like how they look and want to wear them. Regardless the purpose of the pair of shoes the buyer will use them for, they can fetch a pretty profit if done correctly. You just have to be quick to the chase. Many sites like Nike and Adidas will announce when their shoes will be available on which website, like Foot Locker, Chumps.com, etc. Extreme fanatics have even set up bots to automatically buy these limited edition shoes right when they drop, giving no one a chance. The shoes will usually be sold for anywhere from $80 to $220. Once they're sold out, you can see the new ask price on StockX.com. StockX.com is the largest reseller value marketplace for rare clothing and sneakers. For example, back in 2016 when the Yeezy Boost 350 Turtle Dove sneakers were released, your old pal Maximilian here copped a pair for $250. I never wore them saved them in their box for six months. These were sold out everywhere, and people were going insane over Yeezys at the time. I was able to list them for sale on StockX.com and they sold for $2,000. That is almost 10 times the price I paid. Number 4. Sports Cards Whether your favorite sport is baseball, basketball, or football, there's been cards made for each one. Some may bring in more profit than others, you just need to know where to look. In recent days, the major baseball card retailer Topps has released a Project 2020 collaboration with many famous artists and influencers. Some cards of players such as Mike Trout by Ben Baller are now selling for 100 times the price it sold for. This is because some cards sent by the manufacturer can end up being a rare gold label or even autographed by the player. Now with proper grading and appraisal by Beckett, PSA grading the card can sell for even more. This is because cards have a high collectible value and are printed in limited batches. Some are 1 in 100 ever made. In 2019, the famous sports gambler resold the Mike Trout card for $900,000. He paid $180,000 for the card in 2018 and made a whopping $720,000 profit. The reason for the card to skyrocket in value because more and more people are entering the market and collecting rare cards. And as more eyes are on these rare cards, we are going to see a ridiculous rise in prices. You can also stumble upon super rare limited edition cards by buying and opening booster packs. So keep your eyes open for new releases and get your rare cards graded. Number five, refurbished Apple products. Oh, who doesn't like a brand spanking new iPhone these days? However, some people may not have that luxury. And there's nothing wrong with using an older generation model. Now this won't be easy fast profits, as there's some preparation involved. You'll need to browse around on your local selling apps to find someone selling used but in good condition iPhones, Apple Watches, or any Apple device really. Once you find a deal, let's say a good condition iPhone 8 Plus. From just a quick look on OfferUp, one of the most popular buy and sell apps, 
I found this rose gold iPhone 8 for $150 and $3.29 for shipping. On eBay, the very same phone sells for $379. That's a whopping $225 in profit. Now you can also resell the phone on Amazon for a similar price, as both platforms are very trustworthy and you will definitely get paid when listing on them. Now to be successful at reselling Apple products, you have to be diligent in sniping for these deals on the hour, as people who see a good deal will definitely jump in at any chance to get some of the mad profit. And that brings us to a total of five different items you can buy and resell right now to get some extra stacks. Now we didn't say it would be easy, but definitely possible with hundreds of thousands of people trying to resell these products every day. You just need to think quick and begin taking action. As they always say, if you're snoozing, you'll be losing. And you're always stacking if you're never slacking. So I want you to go out there and start making some internet bread. Make Sir Maximilian IV proud. If you enjoyed this video, we definitely have more coming out for you. Drop us a comment down below for any other videos you want to see. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Toodaloo, my dudes. Peace. Peace.